First, you're gonna add your spotty banana to the bowl and mash well with a fork. For a sweetener, I use unsulfured organic molasses. Molasses is an unrefined sugar that's naturally rich in antioxidants like magnesium, potassium, iron, and vitamin B6. You can buy molasses at most grocery stores or on Amazon. I will link the one that I use below. For the yogurt, I use my favorite brand called Maison Riviera. The texture of these yogurts are really amazing. I highly recommend their plain coconut and oat Greek yogurts. Next, you want to mix all the wet ingredients together well, forming a nice base to your cookie dough. Then we're going to add in hemp hearts for all your essential amino acids and 65 grams of vanilla protein. My preferred protein is the Clean Lean Protein from New Zest. I will make sure to link it in the caption below. Then add one teaspoon of pure vanilla bean powder or alternatively vanilla extract and a teaspoon of baking soda. Then add one cup of sprouted oats with the have additional protein and fiber to regular oats and salt. Then just mix everything together really well. Because these are a dense cookie, you don't have to be too concerned with over mixing the batter. So mix until a nice dough forms. Here you can add in your favorite chocolate. Mine is the vegan toffee crunch bar from Zazu Bean. You can add nuts or seeds if preferred. Then just gently fold the chocolate through the batter. You can roll the cookies into eight large breakfast size cookies for 16 grams of protein per cookie or roll into 16 smaller snack size cookies for eight grams of protein per cookie. Add your cookie balls to the baking sheet and gently press each cookie mound down forming a flat circle and top with flaky sea salt, baking for 14 minutes or until lightly browning around the edges. Allow the cookies to cool slightly before enjoying. Thank you for watching and make sure to like and subscribe for more high protein vegan recipes.